Well, welcome back to Spy Fox and Cheese Chase, everybody. We are through the first 20 levels of the game. And we're on level 21 now. Let's get going, Spy Fox! New world! Oh, we're in the Alps now. Alright, we're in the snow, but we're still on the Spy Scooter. Angel Alley. Cool. All the snow angels are here. I bet you there's gonna be cheese on it. Oh no, there was cheese on the other side. Hey, move it, bro! Excuse me, I'm trying to enjoy the Winter Wonderland here. Just like that psalm goes. They just crashed into a tree and didn't crash. Try to figure that out. Don't worry, I shot them with a plunger and they disintegrated. <laughs> Let's see if we can max out the score this game. <laughs> There's my good friend, Wally the Walrus. <laughs> He's a spy too. I didn't make it to be number one in the Spy Academy by plain fair. <laughs> Oops! Oh no, I ran out of gas! In this blasted economy, I can't afford gas anymore. <laughs> Man, this is a long level. And there's a lot of enemies here. Oh well. We just have to play it as it lies. How were they able to just get... <laughs> They crashed into the snowbank, but they didn't actually get, get defeated. I don't understand the physics here. <laughs> Do I have to? So apparently if they run into the trees of their own volition, they don't actually crash. I have to push them there. <laughs> I gotta say, I don't think that's how that works, but alright. I probably should be using more of these plungers. <laughs> Oh, they did crash that time. They hit too many candy. Wow, I think I ran out of gas right before the end of the level last time. <laughs> also, I am—I just now have Spy Fox's voice now. <laughs> Angel Way. That's, that was the name of the last course, wasn't it? Oh no, my Spy Scooter. Well, don't worry, I have 20 extra spy scooters in as backup. I would appreciate it if you got out of my way. I'm trying to get back the legendary Limburger cheese. Well, thin ice. This doesn't bode well. But it's okay, I got through it in the end. How many plungers do I have? I only remember picking up one plunger, or maybe two. Alright then. <laughs> well, this is just going swimmingly. <laughs> Go slower. Angel Avenue. Oh no, it's just Angel and as the adjective for all of these levels. I can't believe people are just leaving gas cans lying out. This is not Puppet Enters the Race. I heard you coming. <laughs> Uh-oh. So if you're willing to lose some points, you can get a big gas can and more weapons that way. <gasps> wow. All right. Please be a gas can this way. That is not a gas can. Wow. That doesn't seem very fair. <laughs> I knew I should have refueled before going on this mission. <laughs> I have a new spy gadget. It's the spy Costco card. It lets you get cheaper gas. 
And also a hot dog and soda for $1.50. Quack, this is probably your best invention yet. <laughs> I actually just bought a membership <laughs> because my box. <laughs> After all, it wouldn't be a colorful arty stream if I didn't give blatant product placement to the places I frequent. <laughs> Alright. Wait, when did my score reset? Did my score reset because I crashed? Oh, I see! There's a counter up here where it's like we have one set of ten... Okay, so you can't max out the score. <laughs> okay, the levels are definitely getting longer and tougher now. I'm gonna go to the left up here and actually take the Limburger cheese. I want the full gas can. And I want the bananas. Oh no! Man, this these levels are... I think we're only going to get through ten levels today. A little bit of a shame. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Okay, I'm not I'm not getting the big gas can this time. It's gonna tank my points. Oh yeah, well Humongous Entertainment loves reusing their assets, which makes sense. All of these are hand drawn, so. Can we please get to the end of the level soon? This is a very long level for very little payoff. Mmm, cheese. There we go, at last. Oh, you did you did redeem spin the wheel of exercise. Cool, I was wondering when people would do that. Alright, here we go. Wheel of exercise where you will turn, and you will make me do ten lunges. Oh, that's easy. Do, 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 do. Just we're gonna alternate with the lunges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Easy. Maybe I should up some of these from ten. <laughs> but there you go. Wheel of Exercise made me exercise. Level 24! I just started the Spy Exercise program and we're here for Angel Cake and Ice Cream. That kind of cancels it out. What? Apparently if you touch cake, your scooter blows up. I've gotta say, I don't think that is true to real life. <laughs> what the heck was that? I hit a cake and just disintegrated. <laughs> it wasn't even like a giant cake, it was like the same size as the cheese I'm eating. I hate birthday cake. I only eat cheese. <laughs> it looks like it's a power up. This is gonna this is gonna mess with me. This is really gonna mess with me because <laughs> that it's, it's designed in a way it looks like you should pick it up. Oh well, that's that's honestly gonna be difficult for me. What kind of cheese do I like? I don't eat cheese straight. Cheese, I think, can be a great addition to a dish, but I would never want to just eat cheese straight. I can't, I can't handle that. Oh my gosh! What on earth? 
This world gave us a big difficulty spike. I love how our gas can literally just deflates as we consume gas. I work in the automobile industry, and I can assure you that is not how that happens. <laughs> Hit him with the banana cream pie. Ooh, that did not look that did not look pleasant. <laughs> well, this is not a piece of cake. You said it, Spy Fox. I can't tell if the penguins I'm supposed to avoid, or if I'm supposed to hit them for extra points. It's like the ducks in Bear Storm, and like, you're supposed to avoid them, but I- it, they made me laugh so much as a kid, just to hear them go, wah, 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 that I kept hitting them. Not- no, not even the loud round one- no, I do not eat cheese straight, period. I'm sorry, so, the tiny, eatsy beatsy insy teensy weensy little, like, baby miniature cupcakes insta-kill you if you touch them, but these gigantic ice cream cones don't? This... I don't... I don't understand this game. <laughs> also, we can throw pies at enemies now. I guess that's kind of cool. I guess throwing pies at guys makes their jet jet engines or zambonis disintegrate, so cake does the same to mine. How are these pies all missing? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Rabbit. There's no way to, that I would know I would have to destroy your stand in order to proceed. Steerick! Pies have a tiny hitbox, too. <laughs> Move it! <laughs> Spy Fox is on a mission. <laughs> and I will not be slowed down by a bunch of monkeys and Zambonis. Well, here we go. Level 26. Ice Cycle! Uh, I... I... <sighs> The cakes are messing with my subconscious. I literally- my brain tells me, hit the cake, it's a power-up. Because it looks like a power-up. Oh, I know what- I know what I can title the episode now, though. Ooh, that looked painful. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> That is ex that is what I am going to call the episode. Excuse me, I don't appreciate you trying to run me off the road. If you do that, I run you off the road. Oh no, the I broke the rabbit's standing! The rabbit's just here trying to make a legitimate business, and I keep destroying his. I feel bad about that. Believe me, nobody values the small mom-and-pop businesses as much as Spy Fox. <laughs> But I'm on a mission, which means I can cause endless amounts of property damage and not have to pay consequences for it. <laughs> Poor Gilbert. I just want to open a trinket stand here in the Antarctic. <laughs> in peace. Oh, are you having cake? Level 27. Let's go. Snow cone. I love this music. The credits music for Dry Cereal. It's so good. Okay, so the ice cream does not give me any extra points, so I should probably avoid it if at all possible. Who in their right mind would pay passing ice cream and be like, I want the cheese? <laughs> like, bro, ice cream is, like, better than cheese. Even if you love cheese, like, come on, ice cream is so freaking good. 
I'm glad the game's putting in a lot of extra lives. Because I am now crashing my scooter a lot. All the walruses are just like, hey. You enjoying our ice cream? <laughs> Booyah! Alright, cool, that was a fun one. Three levels left if this world. Winter Wonderland! In the metal we can build a snowman. And don't crash into the cake! Did he just blow himself up with, like, dynamite? It made the same sound effect as, like, the bowler-upper in the Maze Madness level editor. Oh! Oh, I... Oh, oh my. You know, maybe the penguins shouldn't be standing out in the open if they didn't, like, if they didn't want to be bowled over. I'm not too picky about ice cream. <laughs> that scream playing like five times in a row is great. <laughs> Alright, sweet. Level 29. Let's go. Goon Pops. Is this where I'm going to make the goons go pop? I think that's exactly what we're gonna do. Boop -a -doop -boop -a -doop -a -boop. <laughs> I'm normally not a violent spy, but when I play Cheese Chase, that's an exception. Because <laughs> the game does not give me a. Oh, dude! Two goons with one pie. Now that's what I'm talking about. Whoa, 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 whoa! Poor little penguins. Oh, apparently there's explosives baked in the cake. You know, pretty pretty normal stuff. Do I have a favorite ice cream flavor? Shebane! As opposed to Hebane? Alright then. Uh, my favorite ice cream flavor, so I'm not sure if you guys have this where you are. But at least in the Midwest here, like in the Michigan area, there is an absolutely amazing ice cream flavor called Moose Tracks. It's vanilla ice cream, and it's got, like, swirls of fudge mixed in with it, along with miniature peanut butter cups. And it's... it's extremely good. And I think it's a Midwest-only thing. So, if you're ever in the Midwest... You try the Moose Tracks ice cream. It, it's it's really good. Another ice cream that I had that was really good, uh, I went to Texas last year. Would love to go back. And I went to the Blue Bell Ice Creamery. Blue Bell being, like, a brand of ice cream. They have, like, the actual place that makes the ice cream, and you can tour it. The touring area was closed, but they still had, like, shebane. They still had the actual, like, ice creamery. And you could literally get, like, the freshest ice cream for a dollar, no tax. So I went there and... Okay, all these shebanes. They had, a, they had a bunch of different flavors. They had the usual ones, but they also had some specialty ones. And they had one that I had never seen before. And it's apparently seasonal. And it's called... I think it was Blackberry Cobbler Ice Cream. And it was freaking amazing. And it was only a dollar. Granted, I had to drive over there, and so I would pay, it was a lot more than a dollar in gas, but it was, it was great. It was delicious. And very refreshing. The other flavor of ice cream that's really big in Michigan, and I do think this is Michigan's specific is Superman ice cream. Where it's like, it's multi, it's basically like, it's got like red, yellow, blue, like purple, green, like all of these colors in it all at once. It's basically rainbow ice cream. And it, like, I don't like it. 
but it's big here. I just, I don't generally like fruit mixed with my ice cream, but the blueberry cobbler was an exception. <laughs> Spybox crashes anytime I start mentioning ice cream. It's because I'm paying more attention to my stories than I am to the path of the snowman. <laughs> if your snowman sounds like that when you crash into it, <laughs> you might want to do something. Whee! Shabane! Okay, those rocks have got pretty big hitboxes. You gotta watch out for that. This is a fun game. And, and, and this is also a game where I can just kind of chill read, chat, and talk about weird stuff. What's everybody's favorite flavor of pie? My favorite flavor of pie, without question, is apple pie, but it's gotta be homemade. This is something I've learned. At least, all every store-bought pie I've had has made it way too sweet. I like my apple pie to have, like, the nice... It, it should have, like, a sweet, buttery crust. But the filling itself, I like having kind of tart apples with a little bit of sweetness. But every time it's just like at the store, it's just like, well, I'm eating sugar as the crust, and I can't really taste the apples because they just coat them in sugar. Oh, you live in Texas, X, dude? Nice. I kind of want to move to Texas, but it just depends on if I can get a job down there or not. And there we go. 30 levels of Spy Fox Cheese Cheese. Yeah, um, unfortunately, because of our slow start, we don't have time to do another 10. But oh well. Thanks for joining in for Spy Fox Cheese Chase, everybody. <laughs>